Eddie Hall's hips, glutes, quads, hammies, and even his lats make it look easy. The Bulldog from Britain putting on a display. Success at 1,014 pounds, and he's the co-leader. Well, what Eddie Hall lacked in the plane pole, he certainly more than made up for with this impressive lift in the deadlift. So now it's up to Hathor Julius Bjornsson at six foot nine, the tallest in the competition. Brian Shaw and Eddie Hall have already been successful at 1,014 pounds. Bjornsson is trying to tie them and stay alive. Are you ready? Lift. And he's gonna take his time here, Aaron. This is gonna take everything he's got. And it appears to be enough, Brent. Mm. Half Thor Julius Bjornsson letting the world know he's not ready to go away. So he becomes the third man to get this weight. This really isn't his strong suit necessarily, but he knows what's at stake here. He's going neck and neck with Hall and Shaw. That said, Shaw now has decided not to continue in this event. Claiming his hamstring isn't feeling quite right. So the competition is down to just Hathor Julius Bjornsson and this man, Eddie Hall. And the attempt at 1,042 pounds. Are you ready? Ready? Wow. What can you say? He's the world's best at this event and shows us all exactly why with that effortless rep. Nobody does it better pound for pound in the world than Great Britain's Eddie Hall. 1,042 pounds to stay alive and match Hall. Here's half tour Julius Bjornsson. He gets locked in. Meantime, Eddie Hall looks on. You got to think he's tired of this by now. He's ready for it to be over. <laughs> the question's whether or not Hathor Julius Bjornsson's ready for it to be over. He's going to have to dig deep here. Unable to secure the lift at 1,042, and Eddie Hall wins the deadlift, edging out Hathor Julius Bjornsson. Well, you can tell how much Hathor wanted it, but as soon as you get off balance with that weight, you don't have a chance. Left leg contact with the ground gives way, with Eddie Hall looking on, knowing that he's the best. <laughs> 